friends what's going on today is day four of vlogmas so we are gonna go grocery shopping i have a lot of stuff to buy y'all um our grocery monthly budget is 300 dollars for the whole month for all five of us so let's see if we can make it happen we usually stay under budget let me tell y'all something what's helped me a lot before i would come to the store hungry and just get whatever i saw because it looked so good and it sounded you know so today we picked up subways they have six inches for three dollars so my kids are eating that right now i already ate a little bit and it's not bad you get a six inch for three bucks so it's a pretty good deal so we're definitely not going to be hungry while we shop so we're just going to go ahead and stick to our grocery list and see how much we spend I usually shop for half a month and then around um, around like the midpoint of the month I come back and buy more or less whatever I need I usually like my paper towels and toilet paper and laundry detergent I either get in my Dollar General or now at CVS so yeah guys I have a list hopefully I don't spend too much and hopefully you guys enjoy this video let me know if you guys do like these videos down below comment if y'all have any questions and if you want to see more of these grocery haul videos again let me know down below so I'm gonna attempt to do this with both of my youngest kids my oldest is at school and yeah let's go ahead and start shopping guys I'm picking up six apples they are three for a dollar these are perfect for my I already have them in the cart for my kids snacks I like to cut them up and give them some yogurt or peanut butter with that next are some grapes guys a bag of grapes does not last in my house it finishes very fast and these are a dollar 88 a pound so i'm just gonna get one big bag what are you eating she's eating a elote guys a cup of corn with mayonnaise butter and chile she loves this stuff Next, I'm going to grab some golden potatoes. These are $2.98 for a five pound bag. Oh, but then they have the rusted potatoes for $1.98, a dollar less. Hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and get these. Save a dollar for a five pound bag. It's not bad. Next, we need ranch and croutons for our salads. I'm going to go ahead and get a bottle. This one's $3.88. And then some croutons. The croutons are only a dollar here. So I'm just going to pick up one bag of the H-E-B croutons for a dollar. Next up are pickles. We also like to snack on pickles and popcorn. Or sometimes I like to eat pickles and hot cheetos look this one's 2.42 so i'm gonna go ahead and pick this one up there we go and then right now they have a really good deal on sunny delight it's on sale for a dollar and 78 cents but there's an 80 cent coupon making it only 98 cents and this is for the 64 ounce bottles okay guys next up i need some biscuits for breakfast or sometimes we'll go ahead and make them for dinner we'll make some like pig in the blankets but i like to get these little ones it comes with five and they're little and it's easy for my daughters to roll out whenever we we make those pig in the blankets but yeah i'm gonna pick up three of these next i need a gallon of milk so i'm gonna pick up one gallon of milk for two dollars and 28 cents Guys, she got a hold of some balloons. You can tell she, her dad was a boxer, huh? She likes to punch stuff. Hey, let's get them. Come on. <laughs> Next on the list, we need sausage, bacon, and weenies, and everything. All that is coming up over here. So we're going to get these pork links. It comes with 12 of them for $2.99. There's a coupon right here. No. Okay, so we're going to get some of these. going to get two of these, guys. These do not last very long at my house because my... Ayla actually loves sausage and the deal for bacon is actually pretty good they're two for five so it's 250 a pack there it is I'm gonna pick up two of them let me see I'll pick up this one and this one okay there we go 
Next up, we need some hot dogs, some weenies. So these are priced at 98 cents and it comes with eight of them. So I'm gonna grab two. They like to eat them with egg and then sometimes I just make hot dogs when we need like a quick snack or just a small lunch on the weekend. Okay, next up I need cheese. I'm actually gonna grab the Kraft. They are two for five. But on Fetch Rewards, it gives you points back for these. So I'm going to go ahead and grab two of these. So I need some lunch meat for the sandwiches for the kids. Um, this one right here is 15 ounces. It's priced at $5.48, but there's a dollar coupon making it $4.48. I'm going to go ahead and grab one. What are these? Kitty gels. Um, okay, well, hold on to them zero okay it's fat free we'll see <laughs> i don't think you'll like them because there's no sugar okay guys next we need some sloppy joes so i'm just gonna grab one bottle they're 75 cents we don't eat a lot of this but when we do it's delicious so i'm gonna grab one can all right guys i make beans almost every day but i'm gonna pick up two cans of these chato beans they're at 89 cents a pretty good price for 15 ounces so i'm gonna pick up two cans of these okay guys so now i need bread i'm just gonna grab these large um round top breads for a dollar 58 next up are some cans of whole kernel corns they are priced at two for a dollar so i'm gonna pick up two of these Next up are the burger buns. They're not priced for some reason, but they should they should be like about a dollar. I'm just gonna get the HEB brand, the eight burger buns, and they're the regular size buns. And then I need to get hot dog buns. These balloons keep getting in my face. <laughs> she's having too much fun though. At least she's not running around. Okay, okay, and the hot dog buns are 88 cents for eight, so I'm gonna grab a pack of those too. There we go say hi hi all right guys next i need some noodles and some spaghetti sauce i'm gonna grab i'm just gonna grab these because they like these right here for dollar 28 and the spaghetti sauce i use a certain kind it's the prego brand and then also on fetch rewards you get back points for it i'm gonna use the italian sausage with garlic for dollar 48 i only need one this actually lasts me for two times. So I use half the bottle and then I use half the next time. Next up, we need some Raymond noodles. I have chicken at home already, but we're gonna pick up five of the shrimp for five for a dollar. All right, y'all, so next are fruit cups. I'm gonna pick up a mixed fruit cup for 176. No, you know what, I'm gonna pick up two of these. For both of them will be 176. My kids really do enjoy these. What are you doing there? You're writing on the list? Let me see. <gasps> That's so pretty. Look guys, she fell and bumped her head right here the other day, but it's getting better. Okay, scratch it off, girlfriend. Knock a one. The, the green ones, the cinnamons? Yeah. All right guys, so Ayla wants some of these Quaker. Um, they're 248, they're little rice cakes. So we're gonna pick these up. Which ones? Oh, okay, she wants the apple cinnamon for $1.58. Alright, we'll get these then. <laughs> okay, next we need some cookies. Um, let me see. Look guys, the Chips Ahoy are $2.56 and the H-E-B brand are $2 for a dollar. So I'm just going to pick up two of these. And they're the chewy kind, I like these. <laughs> We got some cookies. These will go towards the girls' snacks. Next up are a few more snacks for the kids. I like these animal crackers. They're a whole pack for 98 cents. And it comes with six of them. What, baby? You want the pin? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, so these will be 98 cents for a pack of six. Oh, my phone's dying, so let's see if we can get through with this. We need some chocolate syrup. These are priced at $1.98. Okay, friends. So my phone ended up dying, but I'm going to go ahead and continue showing you guys what else I purchased 
today at um, HEB. So you guys know, I told you in the beginning that there's a $300 monthly limit on our food. And today I spent, let me see. Today I spent $123.60. So I have a balance left over of $166.46 for you know the remainder of the month so let's go ahead and show you what i picked up first off i picked up this huge tray of the ground chuck this is a 80 percent lean 20 percent fat and this whole thing was eleven dollars and 92 cents and it comes with almost five pounds of ground beef so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna go ahead and split it up and put it in the freezer bags Next up are the seasoned chicken drumsticks. Guys, these are delicious. They're super easy. It's kind of like a put them to cook and leave them. Um, this comes with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight huge drumsticks. It is three and a half pounds, and I only paid $3.47 for this. And my kids love these guys. So I basically make half, freeze the other half, and um, this it lasts us a while. Next up, mainly everything's already put away, guys. I'm sorry, but I did also pick up a case of the Kool-Aid Jammers. These were priced at $1.68, and I got back um, points on Fetch Rewards for these. Next were the Jellos. There are these huge Jellos. Um, they're smaller than the original, if you can see there. Um, it comes with a case of six, and these were priced at $2.48. And then I also got a case of 12 puddings. The 12 puddings cost uh, $2.78. So this is the case of puddings I bought. It is a family pack. It came with 12. So again, it's not bad for $2.78. All right, friends. Next, I picked up two of the bags of Doritos. Um, these, I picked up the Nacho and the Cool Ranch. And these at my local HEB were priced at... $2.98 each. Oh, something fell. $2.98 each. Another thing I picked up were these honey barbecue chicken strips by Tyson. These are priced at $6.98. They're a little bit pricey, but they are delicious. <laughs> These were a big hit with my kids last time. These are the Fun Nuggets. They're like little dinosaurs. And it's a 20 ounce bag. A lot do come in here and they do last quite a while. This big bag was priced at $4.95. And then there is also a rebate on Ibotta for these. And then I also picked up some toaster strudels. The six pack at my store are priced at $2 even. And then these waffles, it comes with eight of them for only 98 cents. So that's a really good deal. Okay, friends, another thing I found, these are actually only $1.27 each, and they are delicious. They're perfect for spaghetti, even to make your own sub sandwiches at home. And then also when I ever, whenever I make my Toscano soup, this goes perfect with it as well. Another thing I picked up, I think these are the last from my freezer section. These are the uh, Hill Country Fair Taquitos, the beef. These are priced at $5.48. These are $2 cheaper than the Del Monte. I think that's how, or something like that. So I just went ahead and got the same amount for a less out of pocket. So yeah, and these are really good, guys. I actually just made some for dinner. <laughs> I also picked up a 32 case of bottled waters. These are only price, priced at $2.98. Okay guys, and then finally I'm gonna show you, hold on. These are the type of storage bags I use. They are H-E-B brand, but they work really good. And they are freezer bags. You get 40 of them for only, I think it was, how much was it? Hold on, these were priced only at $2.68 for 40 freezer bags. Cool. So that was a very, I think that's a steal. Okay friends, so that's it for today. As far as my vlog goes, it's already 6.55 and I'm barely finishing recording this video. So I went grocery shopping, by the time I got out it was already almost, it was 2.00. I had to wait for my daughter, I had to pick her up, I had to come home. 
the food already had been in the car for an hour, so I had to put it away. And then I had to uh, help with homework, clean, uh, get dinner ready, and now we're done with dinner and I'm finishing the video for you guys. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. If you guys have any questions, leave a comment down below. Again, if you guys like these grocery haul videos, I'm not the best at it, but I know I'll get better at it. Just let me know, okay? And you guys have an amazing day. Bye. One more thing before I go, guys. I forgot to mention that I did get money back on Ibotta. Check out 51. I got points back on Fetch Rewards. I haven't calculated the total amount, but I did get a few, about $6 back after all the rebates. So if you guys want to join any of my rebates teams, all the information is going to be in the description box down below. All you have to do is click the link, use my code, and you guys will also get money for just doing it. Um, I think Fetch Rewards right now is giving 2,000 points. Checkout 51 is giving $5 and Ibotta is giving $10. So all you guys have to do is redeem your first rebate, qualifying rebate, and you guys will get that extra cash in your account. So again, till next time. Bye.